The biggest gathering London has seen in weeks and one of the most passionate. What do we want? Justice. What do we want? Now. What do we want? Justice. Now. Protesters were peaceful but angry about George Floyd's death in the US that America's woes of inequality and racism resonated in their lives here. Star Wars star John Boyega said it was time for change. More education, black awareness. I want to be able to have that in this country. But it first starts with us being unified. Police chiefs in the UK offered a message of solidarity to the protesters, saying they too were appalled and horrified by Mr Floyd's death. But that didn't go down well here. The police in the UK have killed people and are held unaccountable for. Look at the T-shirt. These are the names of people they've killed. How dare the chief of police across the country issue a statement saying they're in solidarity with George Floyd. They are disgraceful. They have never been accountable in this country. Well, we've left Hyde Park and we're heading for central London. The police have issued a warning saying that the virus is still out there. There are still restrictions in place to prevent its spread, including people not gathering in groups of more than six people and staying two metres apart. But clearly that's not happening here. People here felt they needed to come together to make their message loud and clear. Look at us, we're in 2020 and this is what we're doing. We're having to walk and to march. Black Lives Matter! Black Lives Matter! Black Lives Matter! There were no mass-produced placards, just simple messages on cardboard. And just as police couldn't enforce social distancing, they didn't properly cordon the route as the march weaved through traffic on Hyde Park Corner. George Floyd died in Minneapolis after a police officer put a knee on his neck for eight minutes. It has parallels with Sean Riggs' death in Brixton in 2008 after being held face down for several minutes by police officers. Sean's sister Marcia says families of those who've died in custody have recently written asking to meet the Prime Minister. But I want people to know that this has been happening in the United Kingdom for decades as well, including with my brother Sean. And to see that video on the TV was so traumatic for me because it just brought, brought my experience back of Sean. It's like it, it happened yesterday. I want to meet him with Boris Johnson so I can speak on behalf of other families that cannot do it. I'm here to do it for them because I know what it's like. As the protests reached Downing Street, there were some scuffles between police and protesters. But in Brixton, there was a more peaceful moment of reflection. Firemen were among those paying tribute to the Black Lives Matter cause. One man's death has rekindled this movement around the world and shown that a pandemic can't stop protest. Jason Farrell, Sky News. We actually had thought that the whole thing had, had, had in fact, uh, uh, simmered down and we were about to, uh, to, 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 to telephone through to our office to say that we were sort of uh, coming back and that it was, it was all finished. But we, we parked pretty much up here, I, I, as I recall, and we thought we were just going to have a look at this area just leading into the estate to see whether it was still, you know, it was all quiet. And when we got down here, well, <laughs> in a phrase, all hell had broken loose. We were greeted by an astonishing sight. The police were lined up along the entrance to the estate and they all had their right shields up. And inside the estate, which we couldn't quite see, we were sort of as far as we could get we over here. And we were looking into the estate, only a, a very narrow window, but in that little window of, of dark sky, lit up by what were probably burning vehicles or burning something, were, the sky was filled with, with, with uh, weapons. Uh, it, it was the expression, I've always heard about this expression before, it was raining missiles, which I always thought was a very strange phrase. That's, but that's what it looked like. You looked up and in the light of the, of the burning vehicles, you could see all this stuff 
raining down on the police who were lined up along here with their shields and you could actually hear all the weapons it was sticks stones all sorts of stuff you could hear it bounce the 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 the, the various weapons bouncing off the 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 police shields i suddenly realized i've been hit because i had i felt a sort of smarting and a sort of stinging sensation uh, and what had happened is some of the pellets had hit me Paul, on one side of me, was completely unhurt, unharmed. The other guy next to me, uh, I understand, lost an eye. So it was totally random what had happened. I had my, my because it had been raining lightly, I had, a, I had a raincoat, but it was, the rain was so light that I didn't actually have it done up. So a lot of the, um, a lot of the pellets actually stuck into the raincoat. Uh, and uh, some of them I was able to actually pick out. Others went into me, but the ones that were causing the problem were the... I had my glasses on, so I, my eyes were okay. But above my eyes, I got one or two cuts, and, the, it, and I suddenly realised, I think it was... Uh, I, I realised I was bleeding, I'd been hit. Within only a few minutes, the ambulance absolutely filled up. There was probably about a dozen, and quite badly hurt police officers. And it was then that I went into shock. I, I'd, I'd never actually been in shock before, but I knew what it was. And I realised why I'd done it. It wasn't so much that I'd been hurt myself. I, I saw the other guys coming in, the, 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 the policemen, who, who some, some of them were quite nasty injuries. And I realised I could have been much more seriously hurt. It's a bit strange. Uh, even at the time, it all seemed a bit surreal. And uh, I, I suppose with the passing years, it's, uh, it's, it's, you know, it's astonishing also that, that we're still hearing all about this now after uh, this incident has, uh, has, has sort of got into everybody's memories and, uh, and uh, a whole new generation now know what the words Broadwater Farm mean. In early January 1981, there was a house fire on the New Cross Road, literally a street away from where we're standing, and 13 young black people died that day. There was a suspicion that it was an arson attack. There had been lots of racist arson attacks in the area. Crime was never solved. But in the aftermath of those events, there was an incredible groundswell of political mobilisation that culminated in this historic march that took place. The exhibition contains a number of photographs that I took. I took the pictures both as a participant in the march, but also in my capacity as an editor at Searchlight, anti-fascist, anti-racist magazine. And it was a rainy day, so people had umbrellas and the, the mood is very grey and sombre. But there's also some sort of celebration as well. But there was a really strong sense of resistance and community and collective action. I think you can tell from people's faces that sort of determination that things cannot go on the same. So the, the march assembles literally outside the college more or less in Fordham Park. On Blackfriars Bridge the police tried to stop the march. The marchers refused to be stopped. They pushed through. The march was represented in very racist ways actually. What is absolutely indisputable is the indifference of the wider society to the loss of those young black lives. What we want to try and do with the exhibit is to bring that history inside the classroom and inside the institution and make that link profound and deep. And so it's a kind of reminder of that history and why it's important.
drawing the buttons. Just another day in Taki. Derby last night. A gang of about 60 youths attacked a club which is used mainly by Derby's Caribbean community. Cars were set on fire, windows smashed and a man stabbed in the fighting which followed. This report from Phil Bales. Police accuse Portsmouth youths of being bent on causing trouble in Derby's black community. Portsmouth Football Club confirmed it believed the attack on the Caribbean club was carried out by a group known as the 657 crew, which has a reputation for attacking blacks. People are out to kill people. There's nothing else the police to and those people and, the, and everybody else didn't come down here till the aftermath. People should, they should have been here before and then. They should have stopped them from before they'd even got halfway down. The police are saying they were Portsmouth football fans. Do you think well, it's no, more serious? No, they're, they're white people. They're white people. They're we don't white care what they're Portsmouth coming down fans, here, Derby fans. Right? To, get, to take black I mean. people out. 35 black youths attacked in the club chased the white gang through the area. Shops and a public house were badly damaged. Car windscreens were smashed. They're animals, mate. It's a hard car, sorry, not me. That's really clever. As clearing up operations began, police praised black community leaders for helping to restore order as 60 Portsmouth youths were rounded up. 20 were arrested and are still being questioned. The rest were taken to the second division match where there was no further trouble. The 20 Portsmouth youths arrested last night are still being questioned by police. Derby's assistant chief constable has said they were not part of the main body of Pompey football supporters and appeared bent on causing trouble. Meanwhile, Ian Gibson, the Portsmouth Council leader, has sent letters of apology to Derby's mayor and city council. Portsmouth Football Club chairman John Deacon is equally unhappy that his club's reputation has been tarnished by the notorious 657 crew. Now, these supporters take their name from the train they used to catch to away matches. They're known troublemakers who've been banned from Fratton Park for three years. 
Rob Widows has been speaking with Mr. Deacon. Portsmouth House always had a very good image, and of course I naturally am very concerned about it. There has been for many years, even before my time, a small element who seem determined uh, simply wherever they go to cause trouble and chaos. They do not represent the club, they do not belong to the club, they are just a bunch of hooligans who decide uh, they're going to cause trouble and unfortunately uh, they still exist. They're in all cities, uh, they cause problems in most of the big cities and uh, we have done our best in and have succeeded in keep, keeping them out of Fratton Park but it's going to be awfully difficult for us to keep them from going to away games. If they're not Portsmouth fans, who are these people? Well, it could, there could be a, a political motive behind it. it. It's not unknown, of course, that uh, these occasions can be used by certain political organisations to cause problems, and uh, uh, it's suggested that perhaps that's behind it all. I don't know. Uh, I have no confirmation uh, to confirm that, but uh, that has been suggested. A statement has been made by the Derby uh, Football Club with which we concur, and it tends to indicate that that really uh, was the cause of the problem. We two workers take to the street are still being held by police after more than four hours of rioting in the streets of Derby last night. The violence broke out in a predominantly black area of the city close to the Derby football ground. Dozens of windows were smashed, a car set on fire, and one man stabbed. But although the disturbances happened on the night that second place Derby took on league leaders Portsmouth, the Hampshire team tonight denied that their supporters were at fault. Mr John Deacon, chairman of Portsmouth Football Club, said there'd been no violence associated with the club for three seasons. He added, if a group of yobbos decide to travel to away games and cause trouble, there's nothing the club can do. From Derby, Paul McRae sends us this report. Violence in the shadow of a football ground. Violence on the streets of Derby. The football clubs say what happened had nothing to do with them but it's thought football supporters started it. It's certain football supporters were among its victims. We came up from Portsmouth today to see the game. We've got 200 miles to go home. I don't know where we're going to get this fixed now. The trouble began a mile from the ground, an hour before kickoff. The target, a social club and amusement arcade used mainly by young black people. The damage was caused by 200 white men, say the regulars, by 60, say the police. Either way, it frightened and angered the people inside. To be in there, quite comfortable and happy and see 200 people descend on the place and start to smash it up and threaten to damage you within that place. It's a frightening experience and people aren't going to just sit back and let people from outside of the community come into a place that is used so regularly by the members of the community and have it smashed up in that way. Their club vandalised, its customers were furious. As one told me, there was a lot of hot blood on the streets last night. In what's thought to have been a revenge attack, the trouble switched to an area close to the football ground. While the game was going on, a gang of black youths surrounded the windmill pub in Cambridge Street. The landlord locked himself in. A tremendous crashing noise and glass, and uh, I came outside to have a look, and car windows had gone through. Uh, some of the pub windows can be seen have gone through, and they just disappeared. Inside the baseball ground there was no trouble, there's not been all season. The stadium's ringed by video cameras linked to a police control room. The fans are strictly segregated. It's difficult, not to say painful, for the hooligans. So the massive crowd at last night's game posed few problems for the massive police presence. A mile away, where few officers were on duty, it was a different story. What happened last night was not spontaneous. It was very well planned. The, the people who uh, evidence suggests now perpetrated this went out of their way to avoid being seen by police officers and the first that we knew about their presence in Derby was when this unfortunate incident happened. We have to look at the question of identity cards. I really do think more responsibility should be placed on the shoulders of the clubs involved and that uh, steps should be taken to enable the courts where necessary to ban visiting supporters where it is thought that trouble may occur. As the MP was urging his ideas on the Home Secretary, the police were left with a dual difficulty. How to reassure the black people in Inner Derby that everything had been done to protect them from racist attacks. How to cope with organised gangs of thugs forced out of soccer stadiums. Suddenly, it seems, anywhere is a battleground. Bread from the rags into the setting. Yeah. 
He then see me and sweating. <laughs> yeah. Lock the door and them can't get in. Badang, 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 badang. Me sing the song. She yeah, know me no need nobody yard. Just me the mic up, make me run the place hard. She yeah, know me no need nobody yard. Just give me the, just give me the, make me run it hard. She yeah, know me no need nobody yard. No need nobody yard. We 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 them should I do so. From you see me face, you see say man a humanitarian. Them should I do so. Me stand up in a the lion den like Daniel them see one. Them should I do so. From you see me face, you see say man a vegetarian. Them should I do so. Me precept long like fit for the Abraham. Rastafari I know. Get ready for we sell a cockle, rock like a buckle, raise like a cattle. This a rap that can't settle. Lyrics me use and come and touch you, but you won't catch you. You be God, say man a God, say I'm a lyrics of this class. I me a lyrics with you much you. I them first start it and then run go for your army. Run go call go army, go army the bike him salami. When me raise Tommy and start stamming, pull out the park and could not call me. Them want me say, Jia no me no need no bodyguard. Just give me the mic, come and me run the place hard, hard. Jia no me no need no bodyguard. Just give me the mic, come and me run the place hard, hard. Jia no me no need no bodyguard. Just give me the mic, come and me. Give me the bubble broom. Me sweep out the cribbies in a damn room Try to challenge me well tonight so I go doom Drop this like a boom, me skip like Daniel Boom, some boy gone too soon Just pick all them hype, hype, hype to them hype out No for them wipe, wipe, wipe to them wipe out No for them pull them, pull them, pull to them all out No for them, them soul, them soul, them soul to them soul out No for them, them dark, them dark to them dark out No for them, them call them, call them, call to them cart out No for them brought out, no get soul out, no can't Pull out, not get ball out and missing me so Ja no me no need no body yard Just give me the mic up make me run the place hard hard Ja no me no need no body yard Just give me the back and me the place hard hard Ja no me no need no me no need no me no need no me no need no No for chat wanna make no sense Give them down killings Now for big empty space Still I say put them with them there No nobody's the man to the And I come with school face Show them a power in at them click them to get the emblem and the meat with one gun from them ways. Me you say how fool them up, sure fool them up, money fool them up. Me you say y'all rule them up, we can boo them up, we can boo them up. Where's my bad and I Yes, I'm ready to stand up and fight as a Rastaman soldier The people, they are crying Oh gosh, in certain part of earth the youths are dying See, it's time we do some trying To help the situation in the very best way we can Just seeds shall bear bread And every mouth out there It's got to be fed Help me sing this song We will never stop trying I'm on my dad I'm trying Grandmother, she is dying She cannot stand up and need some help We will never stop trying Just get up, stand up and be higher Now, whoa, whoa. 
all around the world I see the show so care Love and tender care Don't know what manner of need you care Brother man don't you stand up there Cause I am ready to stand up and fight this revolution Like when Rodney Price to say Rap about support and get cops and not a bay Get sentenced for life, be molesting on a K Now mama she got ball and then poopa in my brain That somehow he would change one day I tell you step away now With your gun thing I rule boys and top ranking This is real and an fun thing Remember Lucifer, the know them on them hunting Step away now With your gun thing I rule boys and top 
ranking This is real and then a fun thing Remember Lucifer, they know them on them hunting I see night, you know them bloody penetrate I tell them for do the right but wrong, them still a meditate I say, clean up your eyes son, before it is too late And dash with the 9 and the rusty 38 I know business if I you a lucky place I am fucked up people so I tell it to your face I what you're doing is a damn mistake Affecting the human race I tell you step away now, with your gun thing I will be boys sent around him This is real and then a fun thing Remember, police step up, they on them hunting I step away now, with your gun thing I rule boys sent around him I, This is real and then a fun thing I lose if I don't know they pun them hunting Aye, yes I know in the turf nor no gang Some little you them off it a silly in a them on And who no boss it is me say a lock it for the gun Can't spell but them know about gun name and brand I tell you say me put it na me song And I uh, hope the people who da really overstand that Jamaica get but your yeah, man Can't cool with AC nor fun I tell you step away now with your gun thing I rule boys and top ranking. This is real and I'm not Remember Lucifer, they know they want them hunting. I step away now with your gun thing. I get in the set the law on his coming. I guess it's real and I'm not fucking. Lucky on his tongue and the This beauty that lies deep inside Can't trust things here, I stop to sing Me not talk no bling and me not boast no Babylon Hear what I'm really trying to say Let's play the play, coming with the one to rain Jarastafari make me stronger every day, yeah Born Babylon, pan the Queen's highway When me say, one, two, you know the score Can't fool me with your Babylon cure Jaja show me, yeah, love is the key Yeah, so what you gonna do when we got this love for I wanna live where my father is Just wanna stay on Mount Zion Hill I wanna live where my father is Just wanna stay on Mount Zion Hill So I'm rolling out to Zion in the righteous way Holy Trinity, put him on your well live beside me Make you know, Jaja set me free Went from downtown to uptown So what you gonna tell me? Confusion in your mind Cause you play their games all the time Games all the time Separate vanity could never be love Hey, Jaja is the one I said It makes me think of Hey, hey Jaja make me strong, make me strong every day Born Babylon, on the Queen's Highway Often make you know is what I got to say yeah, yeah. I wanna be where I'm free and the only place to be free is when I made the Almighty, oh Lord. I wanna live where my father lives. I wanna stay on Mount Zion. I wanna live where my father lives. Just wanna stay on Mount Zion. Freeing up my mind today I'm a lion Moving in the ghetto today And I know you're gonna wanna come here with the roomie Mr. Fumi I don't mind cause you school me Rolling on to Zion is the way for me One illusion Cause them can't say it away Jaja is the one who's gonna set me free And all the money in the world No, it could never be Hey, hey Working so hard To see in the face of the law It's alright No matter how I feed my honey From my use my skills Lock that tight No matter how I make my money From my pay my bills It's alright No matter how I feed my honey From my use my skills Lock that tight Making my money on the street As a hustle last month law As a big entertainer Making the money black man Turn box a footballer Love 
me come shot caller Making the money as a big taxi driver Can live on the bus, them call you conductor Making the money as a street side vendor The president, and me call prime minister Making the money, we no have no time for linger Why you come out fight against them a youth you far Don't matter how I make my money from I pay my bills It's alright, don't matter how I feed my money from I use my skills Lock that tight, no matter how I make my money from I pay my bills It's alright, no matter how I feed my money from I use my skills Lock that tight, yo! People will do what many people won't do In a desperate situation People will go where many people won't go Depends on the meditation Them no no feel love and them no no figure share no more In a world that stop malfunction I could never let go off of the Rasta floor And if I a figure bun corruption Try stop the man from making cheese Babylon boy your skin we get squeezed Man a hustle all when time a free can't stop me can me blow like the breeze, yo Don't matter how I make my money from I pay my bills It's alright Don't matter how I feed my money from I use my skills Lock that tight Don't matter how I make my money from I pay my bills It's alright Don't matter how I feed my money from I use my skills Lock that tight Every man couldn't be a liar, doctor, teacher, or prime minister. Bless up the man where you're the garbage worker. Bless up the man where you're out there as the farmer. Bless up the one day, bless up the one day, bless up the one day. But me tell the youth, me know why you commit murder for paper. Hey, shout the helper. No cash is illegal, remember. From them of a serial, remember. Every man need material, remember. Oh, <laughs> 
just don't know that they ain't talking
drunk pills Me tell grandma the money don't have no bills The money that is built, you have it a special skills You call it what you will, them iron and the house man
Tell Babylon my dead people to leave us alone. Hey, only the people working nine to five, and the grind just to stay alive. Don't treat the people like a dirty fly. It turn my heart till my soul cry. Yeah, this a system you blind you why you need glasses before 35. Then you go prison, make you waste your life Who cares about I and I? World is in trouble In every ghetto there's a struggle Yeah That's why so many people Love fight for your dawn Yeah, they give me on a bubble A little earth but a juggle Yeah Tell Babylon my dead people To leave us alone Get this straight Get the youth from food up on the plate Get the street Get the youth need help to carry the weight Get the street More youth trust to come to elevate And I hope that these words Could make a better change The world is in trouble In every ghetto there's a struggle Yeah That's why so many people love fight for your God Yeah, they give me on a bubble A little earth but a juggle Yeah Tell Babylon my dead people To leave us alone Whoa, whoa Who feels it now? And now the place to sleep Who feels it now? And now the food be Financial meltdown How come Wall Street fell down And if Wall Street fell down Then oh, it no. is in trouble In every I'm day I'm standing up firm to oppression People have heard so I've learned my lesson Not down to the days Give thanks and the blessings Bring them in and the enemies No way not stress it Why should the shadow up Get up in a evil Wicked and corrupt Yes, people are people Smile to your face And they will deceive you Brought to live bad thing I in the what them in ya Rams in a barrel Yes, they want to get the money From Africa to Syria No way not funny Highland they go Yes, they run it till they run out Afghanistan and Palestine Carry out them till them don't know I'm picking on the leaders To bring all the guns out It's from Raka Baka From Sana to Sando We are standing firm Light up the fire and make it burn Standing firm, standing firm One day soon the tables will turn We are standing firm We are we light up the fire, make it burn Standing firm, standing firm One day soon the tables will turn It's like the wild, wild west In a new generation Clans swinging, diamond blinging Media contamination The cycle continues like blood circulation What them I got do when them kill off a nation He don't give a damn Diving in them fast cars Round and round like the moon and the stars Move out to Pluto, Jupiter and Mars Raise up the woman, then put out them fan blast Don't give up the fight Stand up firm Don't give up the fight Stand up firm Don't go 
Ce soir me parle pas de time Des bonnes nouvelles je veux tout connaître dans le détail Miss Ingraven, parle-moi de love, pas de drame Besoin d'être bien, moi j'ai prévu de prendre le la Parle-moi de la forêt qui pousse au lieu de parler de la pied tombée Parle pas d'échec, parle-moi d'essai, parle pas de problème, parle-moi progrès Parle-moi de prose qui bouge au lieu de parler de ce qu'on échoué Parle-moi de la vie et de ses bienfaits, dis-moi quoi neuf J'ai besoin de positif, de bonnes nouvelles, de choses à dire Dites-moi quoi neuf besoin qu'on se pose vite, je crois que j'ai perdu le bout de la vie Quanner, j'ai besoin de positif, de bonnes nouvelles, de choses à dire Dites-moi Quanner, donnez-moi des ondes positives Dites-moi que la vie est simple, pas besoin de la compliquer Qu'à force d'en chercher le sens, on perd la chance d'en profiter Ne me parle pas de problème de maille Parle-moi de soleil après l'orage Alright, je vis l'instant présent Billy Bang, me parle pas de Parle-moi plutôt du temps qui est passé Parle-moi d'idées, parle pas de billets Parle-moi inné, parle-moi d'aimer Parle-moi d'exister, non ne me parle pas d'hésiter Au lieu de rivalité, parle-moi d'égalité Et dis-moi quoi neuf J'ai besoin de positif De bonnes nouvelles, de choses à dire Dites-moi quoi neuf j'ai besoin qu'on se pose vite Je crois que j'ai perdu le bout de la vie Quoi neuf J'ai besoin de positif De bonnes nouvelles, de choses à dire Dites-moi quoi neuf Donnez-moi des ondes positives J'ai juste envie de m'en aller On n'est dit pas condamné Parle-moi du soleil Le reggae music c'est des bonnes voix qu'on amène Parle-moi de Cogine Doré Hotel de Miwantakwan Et à moi Donne-moi que du positif Je crois que le négatif c'est pas fait pour moi Donne-moi des bonnes nouvelles man On avance pas à pas Le destin nous guidera la vie nous laisse le choix, j'ai fait celui de rester moi même Même si l'époque me malmène Man, demain je serai peut-être plus là Donc avance pas à pas, le destin te guidera Et chaque jour la vie te laisse le choix Fais celui de rester toi même Même si l'époque te malmène Aïe, demain je serai peut-être plus là 
Tiens, ce sera la dernière cartouche Sois pas la victime, ne joue pas sur la touche Il ne tient qu'à toi d'agir pour que le monde bouge Mais c'est one by one On avance pas à pas, le destin nous guidera Et chaque jour la vie nous laisse le choix J'ai fait celui de rester moi-même, même, même si les portes me malmènent Aïe, man, demain je peux plus là Donc avance pas à pas, le destin te guidera Et chaque jour la vie te laisse le choix Fais celui de rester toi-même Oui, on n'a qu'une vie donc on peut bien se permettre Qu'importe le rythme tant qu'on peut avancer On doit pas renoncer J'aimerais passer ma vie dans les étoiles Oui, dans les étoiles Mais Babylone ne veut pas se rendre Ni comprendre qu'on prenne le temps de vivre ensemble Dans chaque épreuve, cherche manière du bon à prendre On avance pas à pas Le destin nous guidera Et chaque jour la vie nous laisse le choix J'ai fait celui de rester moi-même Même si les portes me malmènent Aïe, man, demain je peux donc avance pas à pas, le destin te guidera Et chaque jour la vie te laisse le choix Fais celui de rester toi-même, même si les portes te malmènent Demain on sera peut-être plus là, yeah Moi je voudrais vivre de ma musique, votre monde m'a usé Je veux plus redescendre, yes Je garde la tête froide et je reste lucide Je ferai tout pour y arriver, et pour un jour chanter, oh If you don't know the way to life, you might not need to see tomorrow. A simple city and the way of life, so I'm gonna live it in a sorrow. But the righteous way to life, and us and them and go tomorrow. Alright, say live it up, live it up. You live it up, don't give it up, give it up. Don't give it up, dig it up, dig it up. You don't feel dig it up. Cause each and every man, they want to live big enough. From Moran, they go straight to Stony God. All Bogle walk and no road never cut. Well, if they get a youth man, start to step up. They want to live a better life, tell them keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Who don't feel keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Who don't feel keep it up. The road might a rocky and the hills might a tough. The mark a so scratchy and the gully so rough. Teach you them the way of life so them all can follow. Cause if you don't know the way to life, you might not need to see tomorrow. A simple city and the way of life, so not a live it in a sorrow. How about the righteous way to life and us and them and go tomorrow. Alright. Me so no can't fool them out here, yeah. none of them no shooter Each and every one of them you see them are the future Don't buy them soul fee no car nor no scooter No National Express, no buy it fee no juta Me so to the juta, me come fee revoluta Me so cut in it now with the rest when they muta From the policeman go straight to the paratrooper Tell the government them no fee in a no quota With the wicked man we dress up in a suta Well I am the save and kill all the youth yeah. No for them a looter them say one a shooter Me get fin who say that them is a blasted bro Teach you them the way of life So them all can follow Cause if you don't know the way to life You might not need to see tomorrow A simple city and the way of life So rather live it in a sorrow How about the righteous way to life And us a dumb and go tomorrow Alright So live it up, live it up you live it up, no give it up, give it up Don't give it up, dig it up, dig it up You know to dig it up Cause each and every man them want to live big enough From Moran, they go straight to Stony God All Bogle walk and no road never cut Well if they get a youth man start to step up They want to live a better life, tell them keep it up, keep it up, keep it up Who know to keep it up, keep it up, keep it up Who know to keep it up The road might a rocky and the hills might a top The mark a so scratchy and the gully so rough Teach you them the way of life so them all can follow 
Cause if you don't know the way to life You might not need to see tomorrow Father, who created everything, 
Give thanks for the life you were living Give praises to the kings of kings And you should have faith in the Father Don't throw it all away Because he's the one who protects us You are our living day by day You got to kneel down and pray His love endure it forever And he is your protector Who gives you blessings every day And life that he has given He can take it away So I'm asking you brothers and sisters Give thanks and praises every day The dark is not for the children of Zion But for the evil and the iniquity workers And for those who don't believe In the works of the eyes This one is for each and every man. Strictly education. Just wake up. Baby, old nation. This one is for each and every one. Strictly education for the whole nation. This one is for each and every one. Strictly education for the whole nation. Education, 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 education
This one is for each and every one Strictly education For the whole nation This one is for each and every one Strictly education For the whole nation Close to As 
Cause I dream just keep on a search Till I found out your love is yours, my girl Come not to y'all come, just stay with I come You are so clean and there's no one in this earth I would say Come naughty girl, come, stay with I, come You smell so clean and there's no one in this earth I would say Come naughty girl, come, stay with I, come You are so clean and there's no one in this earth I would say Whoa, see Come naughty girl, come, stay with I, come The biggest gathering London has seen in weeks, and one of the most passionate. What do we want? Justice! What do we want? Now! What do we want? Justice! What do we want? Now! Protesters were peaceful but angry about George Floyd's death in the US, that America's woes of inequality and racism resonated in their lives here. Star Wars star John Boyega said it was time for change. More education, black awareness. I want to be able to have that in this country. But it first starts with us being unified. Police chiefs in the UK offered a message of solidarity to the protesters, saying they too were appalled and horrified by Mr Floyd's death. But that didn't go down well here. The police in the UK have killed people and are held unaccountable for. Look at the T-shirt. These are the names of people they've killed. How dare the chief of police across the country issue a statement saying they're in solidarity with George Floyd. They are disgraceful. They have never been accountable in this country. Well, we've left Hyde Park and we're heading for central London. The police have issued a warning saying that the virus is still out there. There are still restrictions in place to prevent its spread, including people not gathering in groups of more than six people and staying two metres apart. But clearly that's not happening here. People here felt they needed to come together to make their message loud and clear. Look at us, we're in 2020 and this is what we're doing. We're having to walk and to march. Black Lives Matter! Black Lives Matter! Black Lives Matter! Black lives matter. There were no mass-produced placards, just simple messages on cardboard. And just as police couldn't enforce social distancing, they didn't properly cordon the route as the march weaved through traffic on Hyde Park Corner. Say his name! George Floyd! Say his name! George Floyd! Say his name! George Floyd died in Minneapolis after a police officer put a knee on his neck for eight minutes. It has parallels with Sean Riggs' death in Brixton in 2008 after being held face down for several minutes by police officers. Sean's sister Marcia says families of those who've died in custody have recently written asking to meet the Prime Minister. But I want people to know that this has been happening in the United Kingdom for decades as well, including with my brother Sean. And to see that video on the TV was so traumatic for me because it just brought, brought my experience back of Sean. It's like it, it happened yesterday. I want to meet him with Boris Johnson so I can speak on behalf of other families that cannot do it. I'm here to do it for them because I know what it's like. As the protests reached Downing Street, there were some scuffles between police and protesters. But in Brixton, there was a more peaceful moment of reflection. Firemen were among those paying tribute to the Black Lives Matter cause. One man's death has rekindled this movement around the world and shown that a pandemic can't stop protest. Jason Farrell, Sky News. In early January, 1981, there was a house fire on the New Cross Road, literally a street away from where we're standing, and 13 young black people died that day. There was a suspicion that it was an arson attack. There had been lots of racist arson attacks in the area. The crime was never solved. But in the aftermath of those events, there was an incredible groundswell of political mobilisation that culminated in this historic march that took place. The exhibition 
contains a number of photographs that I took. I took the pictures both as a participant in the march, but also in my capacity as an editor at Searchlight, anti-fascist, anti-racist magazine. And it was a rainy day, so people had umbrellas and the, the mood is very grey and sombre. But there's also some sort of celebration as well. But there was a really strong sense of resistance and community and collective action. I think you can tell from people's faces that sort of determination that things cannot go on the same. So the, the march assembles literally outside the college more or less in Fordham Park. On Blackfriars Bridge, the police tried to stop the march. The marchers refused to be stopped. They pushed through. The march was represented in very racist ways, actually. What is absolutely indisputable is the indifference of the wider society to the loss of those young black lives. What we want to try and do with the exhibit is to bring that history inside the classroom and inside the institution and make that link profound and deep. And so it's a kind of reminder of that history and why it's important.